Hello, this is Brad Peebler with the Foundry NAB 2016, and we are here at the Concept VR booth, and I'm pleased to be talking with CEO Jürgen Geerds. Hey, welcome to our booth here. Thank you. It's great to be here. So uh, tell me a little bit about what Concept VR has been up to and what you're showing at the show. So at Concept VR, we are showing off some recent launches of products that we did. Um, our piece that we're most proud of was a rocket launch of a Delta IV for the United Launch Alliance. Very exciting because nobody has filmed a 360 successfully. Yeah, how, how do you? How, how, what kind of access do you have to have to film a rocket launch of a 360? I mean, because the camera has to be right there. So we were very lucky to get extreme access because we were ULA contractors, so we had free access on the pad and all launch facilities, not like normal media has. Did you have to have a special rig to, to protect the, you know, in that environment? So because the rocket launch throws lots of dirt and dust and of course sound pressure and sound waves at you, we had to use actually on the close-up shots our F360 broad, um, Explorer on it, which is semi-waterproof in this context because we just wanted to protect the camera from flying debris mostly and we used open bags with Switronics back, uh, battery eliminators. And so uh, t tell me a little bit more about uh, the products and services that uh, the Concept VR would, uh, would offer to our community. So Concept VR is a full production agency in New York City. We offer everything from consulting you on if a project is actually valid for 360 or it should be handled in traditional media. We do directing, we do pre-production, we do actually the production and the camera work and then of course we do the post-production on everything. So as a uh, kind of a leader in the uh, post-production and production of, of 360 video and, and, uh, and VR, what are the uh, kind of most common challenges that you're uh, encountering on a day-to-day -day basis? Well, our most common friend in post-production is how do we handle parallax, because parallax is inherent in all 360 rigs, as we know. So how can we compare, adjust the images to make it seamless, especially since we do uh, in a, rendered in a sort of 3D way while we're still doing actually 2D video. And so do you guys uh, create some of your own uh, tools and technology for your production or are you using uh, off-the-shelf uh, wares and just uh, plowing through? So originally we were very, very happy to partner actually with Color. The AVP software was actually written for me so okay. you see many of the influences of what AVP is today coming from us here at, K at KVR. But we are now very happy to see how um, the new workflow comes in from Nuke and see actually our F360 systems actually as templates already in there helping the user to really just get the data in and use it right away in the Nuke workflow. That's one of my favorite things about Cara VR is the, the drop down that allows you to pick some of the more common rigs and it's been great to, to, to work with companies like yourselves to, to get that access and, and make sure we can support those right out of the gates. Yep. That's absolutely correct and it's, it's great that it's also open and flexible so we can have our new rigs that are coming up. We're going to also integrate it very soon with the new data. So what's coming up from Concept VR? What should we be looking out for? Uh, we do hope to have another rocket launch coming up soon. Um, one of our customers is going to release a very interesting piece about fish farming in Panama. And because they are very keen on sustainable fishing, so we produced a piece for him that talks about how fish farming works in an economic way. And we have some awesome underwater footage also from this project. So as you're bringing it, as clients are coming to you and, you, and your name is getting out there as being on the forefront of, of this type of production, uh, do you see any trends of, of what types of media people are, are looking for, or is it just all over the map? It is pretty much all over the map, and we are very lucky to have high-end productions in our house to really focus on the future of storytelling and really push the VR medium as we know it today really forward. Well, thank you very much for taking time with us today. We deeply appreciate it. Thank you so much. Cheers.